Hey guys, it's Darren at Black Guy, and welcome back to another video. This video is going to be more of an opinion slash thoughts video over Advanced Warfare. Advanced Warfare, I've played it for about a day and a half now, and I can basically sum it up saying, um, this is a pretty good ass game. I'm not gonna lie, this game is actually pretty freaking fun. Like, the time that I've played it and noticed a lot of stuff in the game, it's not that bad. Like, the guns are balanced enough to it's playable uh there are some obviously flaws with the game like uh the game chat being up in your well not the game chat when people talk in game chat like their names like right in your face like there are some flaws no game's perfect there are some flaws in this game though there's uh the connection is kind of uh iffy a little bit um i can understand that with so many people playing this game already if you're playing it right now and you've witnessed the uh the lag issues uh it can happen but um like i said no game is perfect but overall, this game is pretty freaking good. Like, I honestly didn't think this game was going to be good just because of how bad Ghost was. And I'm glad Sledgehammer Games, I'm like, I, like, if you're watching the Sledgehammer Games, you're probably not because of how small my channel is. But uh, if you're watching this, I, I thank you very much. Thank you so much for making this game as good as it is. Because I don't think I could have played another bad Call of Duty. It would just, I probably would have stopped playing Call of Duty altogether. I'm not the biggest Call of Duty fan, but I enjoy playing Call of Duty. I'm glad that this game wasn't a complete letdown. <laughs> but the game modes in this game, there, there's, there's like one game mode that I really enjoy called Momentum. Um, if you've seen it or if you've played it before, it's it's pretty fun. If you haven't played it, I definitely recommend it. And also recommend this game. If you have 60 spare dollars to, to I guess, waste on a an old video game, pick up this game because this game is. Uh, you'll be surprised how good this game is. I know it's a lot different from other Call of Duties, but the fact that there's all this jumping and exosuits and futuristic stuff in this game, that's what makes it so unique and like fun to play. Like, I didn't think I'd have this much fun playing like a Call of Duty like this, but I actually am. Like, I actually am actually having a good time playing this game. I, like, it sticks to you. Like, Ghost like kind of like rubbed off really easily, and I, and a lot of people notice how bad it was. But this game it like sticks to you. Like, like I guess like Black Ops One, if you enjoyed Black Ops One, or like uh, if you enjoyed Modern Warfare Two, like, it, like games like that, like they stay with you. and You remember how fun they are. Like this game is is just really fun. Like and it, I just love playing it. But this game is a lot different from it. It's not your average average Call of Duty. Like it is pretty high tech. I will give you some tips. I guess since this is an opinion, this is basically like like a tips as an like opinion if that makes sense but this game it's it's not like other Call of Duty's like it's really fast paced and you gotta like always keep your game up like if, if you play slow um like Call of Duty games this is not probably not not the game for you because you have to be quick with this game like all the maneuvering and whatnot if you can master that you're you're pretty smooth sailing with this game because uh you'll probably be really good at it because all the jumping and stuff and all the like the, the evading past bullets and whatnot, it's it's a lot in this game. But um overall, this game's pretty good. Like when I was playing the other night, I, I noticed in uh, game chat, like I like if you've seen the game chat already being really large on your screen, like people actually enjoy this game. Like I'm really surprised. Like I actually after hearing people in game chat, like they say, like, oh this game's really fun. I didn't think I'd enjoy this as much. And people were talking about ghost, how it sucked, and you're like, yeah, fuck ghost. Uh, I agree with him because that game was shit, but this game if I can't wait like honestly in my opinion I cannot wait for the DLC to come out for this game I, Like I really want to see what Sledgehammer can offer us because so far they've offered us a pretty uh, Pretty good gift of what they have because I remember they helped with Modern Warfare 3 And I guess that's why like, Modern Warfare 3 wasn't a complete like bust thanks to uh, Infinity Ward with their um I guess intellectual selves uh, mate with making video games. If they're watching this and they flag it, then obviously uh, they jelly. <laughs> but um, this game, it's it's uh, it's really good. I'm I'm just gonna say it. If you if you hate me, then hate me for saying that. I, I'm I'm sorry, but this game is really good. And what makes me so happy about this game and makes it so enjoyable to play, <laughs> I may get hate from this, but. I'm really glad that the snipers are not the best in this game. Like the snipers, I've tried it myself, and the snipers are bad. I'm, <laughs> I'm really glad. Um, but um, because I honestly cannot stand getting sniped. It just, it just ruins my whole, I guess, perspective and just whole experience for the game. And uh, like just, it just ruins it all together because I'm on like a good roll and then I just get sniped, and it just, it just completely shut down. Like it's just like shut, shut up and sit down. 
and that's how that's how sniping is but not only do snipers ruin my experience the gamers themselves like i'm not trying to like diss any gamers or whatever but like the way people play call of duty past future call of duties like the way people play those past future call of duties most of them don't play this game like they play the old call of duties like which i'm glad about because people are actually trying to like switch things up and not play like the same way even though like you can actually use cloak and camp in the corner and i've seen people i've seen a few people do that before they just sit in the corner and just camp their ass off because i guess why not but overall I'm gonna give this game out of 10 I'd say I'd say like an 8 that's I guess that's pretty high I don't know really know how the scale goes with that like what's what's good and what's not like I know like IGN gives like some pretty low scores for some games and like GameSpot and whatnot but um I, I give this game an 8 this game is uh pretty enjoyable um after this after making this video after posting I'm probably gonna go back and playing it with my friends because uh, that's what I was doing before I left to make this video um, but if you did enjoy this video, feel free to leave a like. It's really appreciated. And subscribe if you haven't already because I love to entertain some more people. Also, comment if I should do anything with this game. Like, would you enjoy seeing stuff of this game? Like, games of momentum. I guess commentaries of, like, about things. I don't know. Just any ideas that you have, just go ahead and just toss them in the comments. I'll, I'll always read them. That's, that's what I do. But as always, guys, I'm the Internet Black Guy. I will see you all next time.